to Fame Story TV, the channel that brings you the untold stories of those who left their mark on the world. Today we remember and celebrate the lives of remarkable individuals who have sadly passed away. But before we dive into their incredible journeys, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell to stay updated on our daily stories. Gembong Warsono was born on the 8th of June 1963 in Indonesia. Gembong was an Indonesian politician of the Indonesian Democratic Party of Struggle. He was elected twice into the Jakarta Regional House of Representatives, serving as a member from 2014 until his death in 2023. He had led his party's faction in the legislature and was a critic of Governor Anies Baswedan. During the governorship of Anies Baswedan, Gembong was a frequent critic of Baswedan's policies. Gembong attacked Baswedan's policies which involved firms owned by the provincial government, which he referred to as policy smuggling. Gembong Warsono died on the 16th of October 2023 at the age of 60 and he died from heart attack. Piper Laurie was born on the 22nd of January 1932 in United States. Laurie was an American actress. She's known for her roles in the films. She received various accolades, including a Primetime Emmy Award and a Golden Globe Award, in addition to nominations for three Academy Awards. She's also known for her performances as Kirsten Arneson in the original TV production of Days of Wine and Roses, and as Catherine Martell in the television series Twin Peaks. In 1979, she appeared as Mary Horton in the Australian movie Tim opposite Mel Gibson. Piper Laurie died on the 16th of October, 2023 at the age of 91, and she died from short illness. Andy Bean was born on the 13th of March, 1953 in United States. Andy Bean was an American professional golfer who played on the PGA Tour and the Champions Tour. Bean won numerous tournaments at both the amateur and professional level. Bean won 11 PGA Tour events, including the 1986 Byron Nelson Golf Classic and three events on the Champions Tour, including a nine-stroke victory at the 2008 Charles Schwab Cup Championship. Bean never won a major championship, but he finished second three times. He had a solo second place finish behind Jack Nicklaus at the 1980 PGA Championship. Andy Bean died on the 16th of October, 2023 at the age of 70, and he died from complications of double lung transplant surgery. Park Siobo was born on the 15th of November, 1931 in South Korea. Park Siobo was a South Korean painter known for his Ecriture series, involvement in the Korean art informel movement, and particular formal concerns around painting that have led critics and art historians to identify him as a leading Dansequa artist. Park was part of the first generation of artists to begin building their careers in the wake of the Korean War after growing up under Japanese colonial rule, having their study interrupted by the outbreak of the Korean War, and surviving the conflict. Much of Park's early work emerged in response to his own experiences at the time. Park Seobo died on the 16th of October 2023 at the age of 91, and he died from cancer. Rosetta Cutolo was born on the 1st of January 1937 in Italy. Rosetta Cutolo was an Italian mobster and the sister of the Camorra boss, Raffaele Cutolo, head of the Nuova Camorra Organizzata, an organization he built to renew the Camorra. As her brother spent most of his time behind bars from where he sent out his instructions, the everyday running of the enterprise was entrusted to his older sister, Rosetta. In October 1981, police raided her stronghold while she was presiding over a meeting of the NCO. Cudolo escaped under a rug in a car driven past checkpoints by the neighborhood priest. She was not seen in public thereafter for over 10 years and directed operations from a series of safe houses in different cities. Rosetta Cutolo died on the 16th of October 2023 at the age of 86, and she died naturally. Thank you for joining us on this episode of Fame Story TV where we remember and pay tribute to the remarkable people who passed away today. If you found this video inspiring and informative, please give it a thumbs up. See you in the next episode.